Hello everybody, how's it going and welcome back to Suits, the business RPG. Last time uh, we went about the office building uh, in the office sector and uh, just killed a ghost and we found our friend Jerome here and uh, yeah we got lots of sandwiches, it was a great time. Now, I can't remember what we were meant to do. We need a station 5 ticket to enter there. We need a station 4 ticket to enter there. We need a station 3 ticket to- alright I see. So clearly, clearly, we have, we have mis, misplayed here by leaving the office district. Clearly there was more to do. Well that's good, so it keeps it, we know that it sort of keeps things restricted to each individual area. Good to know, good to know. So it's like this is its own self-contained little segment. I think we got, we got like, we got like tasked with not like evicting someone or something like that. I can't remember though. Uh, right. So presumably we'll have to stick to the office building. He said something like then in the residential suite, like 48th floor or something like that. So if we head up to the roof, let's talk to this guy, see if he says anything. You broke my crowbar. How many boxes did you destroy? Only one. Who designed it this way? The poor man starts sobbing. I'm sorry, man. Candy, why? Oh, poor Brax, or whatever his name is. And then Fax wants to jump. We knew that already. Alright, so uh, what are our other options? 50 second, right? Let's go to the 50 second residential floor. We'll talk to everybody else again. Because like, we were tasked to nail somebody. But unfortunately, we have nobody to nail. We beat Wife Beater uh, Thingy, whatever his name was, Wife Beater. Whoa, we're in the old lady's house. What are you selling? Whoa, Christ! Oh! Old lady, <laughs> she is horrid. Alright, we'll start. Throw the case at her. Jerome, show me some staple down. Doosh, missed. Well, thankfully we managed to do 52. Not bad. Right, one more attempt. Staple down. Show me it again, Jerome. Paralyzed! Well, that would explain why she's in a wheelchair then. Ah, 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 that was horrible. I'm so sorry. Keep hitting her. Her wheelchair begins to transform. Jesus Christ, it's the old. The old. She is going to cause some havoc. Uh, we don't have any fuel left, but to be honest, her basic melee attacks do plenty of damage. What's she doing? What is she doing? She's still paralysed. Jesus Christ, she's getting some pretty poor rolls. And that was that. <laughs> poor old lady, I'm so sorry. She's like, Aah! She just disintegrates into nothing. Hey. Hey, it's your boss. Hey, it's your boss. Come back to my office and I can give you further instructions. Sounds good to me. She can't move. You don't want to know who or what went down on this bed. Ugh. That was the lamp I was investigating. It's an oven. Nothing in the oven. It's a sink. Nothing in the sink. The huge boom hypothesis starring Sheldon. <laughs> Alright, I see what they did there. Like, like the Big Bang Theory. There's Lucille and there's Ivy. Oh, it's absolutely fantastic that everybody uh, names their plants. I think that's really sweet. Either way, this strange fella just standing in the middle of nowhere not doing anything. We've got to, got to go back up to the 14th floor and then we can roll on up to our CEO and turn in the quest. You did a good job catching that corporate criminal. She's been taken to the courthouse in the law district. You should head over to the law district to make sure that criminal is put behind bars. Or sent to the labour camps. Here, take this. You got the station 2 ticket and $500. Use this to get to the law district. Go make that old bet pay for not buying. Well, with pleasure, Mr. Floyd. I can probably do that with great ease. Look at us, we are just nonplussed about the whole situation. We're like, well, another day. Anyhow, back onto the first floor. Let's head back out again. Uh, how much money have we got? Maybe it'd be better to... We got 5,100. Sweet Jesus. We don't really need the weapon upgrade. Presumably there will be another... Uh, presumably there will be another salesman in the next section, so I think it's better to... It's better to save our money before we go into the next business area. Law! We'll save to which file? We're going into law! Do you wish to go to the law district? Law. Everybody's going to be a lot more suave here, I'd imagine. Freedom isn't free. That'll be $29,995, says Chief Justice. Chief Justice! Freedom isn't free! That's uh, fair enough. Enough of that. Law district. Let's start from the left and work to the right. First. There's Izzy, and there's 
Uh, Irene. There's nothing in there, though. This guy says, When I stare into the waters of the fountains around the city, I forget about all the political issues that plague the world. Then Met says, the Chief Justice had his hands replaced with gavels over 200 cycles in the past. Twice the gavels, twice as much laying down the law, he told me. <laughs> there you go, that makes sense, I suppose. I mean, if you're looking to just judge twice as hard, then make sure your hands are gavels. Saves you, saves missing things out. Is there a banana in my pocket? No, I guess I'm just happy to see you. Whoa, Phil. Oh, he gave us a tasty sandwich. Oh, well, that's, that's nice of you, Phil, you filthy bastard. Trying to play jokes on me again. We got another sandwich out of a bin, but presumably it's wrapped. So, uh, so, uh, yeah. We, we don't have to worry about that. Here's this fella, Reg. I'm too poor to win any of these court cases. It's basically justice to the highest bidder. I guess that isn't very just at all. I should keep quiet. I've heard stories of people disappearing when they talk about controversial topics, like in America. Eh, uh, I feel bad for that guy. He's just suffering, suffering in the law. He's in the law district, but he can't pay for law. The poor fella. Ned says, I buy at least 17 new things each day. The best thing about buying is that it can't possibly be harmful. Oh, I'm not feeling so well. Whoa! Is there something on my face? That's weird. He's just gone. He's just half, he's been hoffed. He's been, he's got a chunk clean out of him. That is a shame. Poor Ned. Oh, I feel for you. Now we've got Ezel. We've got nothing in the bin. And we've got Erica, like in Pokemon. And then we've got Jess. Oh. And a sandwich in the bin. Nice one. <laughs> I love climate change. I can feel the tingles of deadly radiation on my skin and it feels so invigorating. Bill leans towards you and whispers something. We're all going to die. That was my ASMR. The next guy's going to be all in whispers. There you go. I could do it. I should do it. I'll do an entire ASMR Let's Play in the future. Sorry, I wasn't reading that there. A truck in a world with no roads. It's like a man in a world with no women. Well, that's a... That's a bizarre metaphor. Although it kind of is, in a way. I can see where they're coming from. Is this another salesman? Hope it is. Hey, Mac. You looking for a good time? I'm not looking for sex. What do you have in stock? So you got, he's got steroids, triple attack bonus does 150 self damage. So you do 150 self damage, but then you do triple attack. That's pretty cool, actually. It could be useful after a certain point in the game, but I'm not really one to... 10% chance they give you a stroke if you take speed. That's awful. Nah, I don't think I'll be, I think I'll be steering away, guard. Sure, I'd love a good time. Do you wish to take the mysterious substance? Hell yeah, I want to take the mysterious substance. Welcome. To a world beyond space and time. It's like Far Cry 4 all over again. I like these little nubs that are coming out of the ground. They seem friendly. They look like they've got little noses. The ashes! I'm not your buddy, pal. The future. Mark my words. Mark my words. Mark my words. Cas, 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 cas. This is weird. And this one's like. You've done what you've done. He knows. He knows more. Welcome back. What is the meat? They know. No, no. Whoa. Yo. Yo. What was that all about? Yo. There he is. I see him. <laughs> that was cute. Chosen one. Back in, why when I was in high school, me and a big huge group of pals, I wasn't like the ringleader or anything like that, this is just what we did. Uh, at break time, we would stand in a big line on either side of like the doors that led into the, like, the area that we could all hang about in at break. And then we would just pick like a second year at random and then like flood all around them and all scream chosen one. And then just like, not, not like hit them or anything like that, just like sort of muscle them around. And uh, yeah, we did that pretty much every break time for a long period of time. Nobody ever got hurt, it was always in a good laugh. Only then one guy eventually like took it too seriously and he got his brother down to the school and then he punched one of my pals in the face. But that was it, that's a story for another time. Yo! I wanna get it, get it, it's gone. Sad. What's this guy got to say? You. This guy got to say? You. Oh, I like you. Hello. You are, you are good. 
Look at your big face. You are a gyro. I'm a gyro. Oh, Look at you though, you are adorable. He's like a sort of pleasant Jabba the Hutt. More of him. Yo, 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 yo. What's happening here? I like these little palm tree men as well. Cleanse thine filthitude. Oh dear. Clones. Can't speak to him because we can't get to the bottom of him. That's a shame. Oh, I want to speak to them. I want to speak to them all. What's he got to say? Sometimes I feel like the whole world is a video game. The hump. Oh. I, like, I really love the L M N O P. Hang on. L M N O P. Oh, he's just saying the alphabet. I guess it. Use space to interact and open doors. I can guarantee we'll never actually have to open a door. I know your desires. The plants, the plants. Chems. And then this fella. T. Cool. This is trippy as anything. It's all about who you know. I'll be the CEO. He. Stubbs. <laughs> I know that's Stubbs. He's like. <laughs> I like Stubbs. I hope he gets. I hope we get him as a companion. Dude, what? Wait, dude. Wait, wait. Is that all? What all the all of them have got to say? The guy that killed Hitler is my hero. Dude, what? More of that. More of those guys. They are fun. A55. Paper hat. We've got one of them. Where is when? Toots. A Fletcherlands RPG. Toots. A fl <laughs> <laughs> On. Wait, hang on. Keep. On. Keeping. On. Uh, of course. Freedom is responsibility. It is true. It is true. With personal freedom comes personal response. You know, you know how they say a great wise man once said, "With great power comes great responsibility." Either way, let's carry on through this trippy wilderness and try and figure out how to get out of here. Friend forever. The ashes were eyes. See. Mark my words, shrub, like scrub. Bring me the bean. With pleasure. Turpines. Turpines. Should say. See. Eternal infinity. He knows he's got it. He knows what's right. Look at his wee face. Just like, huh. These guys though, they are having a bad time. You. Alright, oh, they say you because they look like you. Right, I get it. Will I live to, to dream again? Maybe it will. Oh, he's so depressed. He's just there like, oh. This trippy world. I like the big sock guy. He's a big. He's, he's quality. Revive the undying. Bring dimensions to our. Then he was cut off. Right, I can't talk to everybody. This is taking absolutely forever, and none of them have anything to say. So let's carry on. Let's carry on. Oh, we found it. Kisses for the missus. And we will always love you. Oh, those friendly guys. Are you ready to come down? Take your time. Okay, are you ready to come down? May Mark Judy guide you. Here we are in the law district, we're like, oh, <laughs> we just wake up like, oh, oh, what was that? Oh god, we got a copy of Shot in the Dark from the, uh, from that. Well, that was a weird, uh, weird sequence there. Don't know what to make of that, but we did it. We, we, we made it through the drug trip and we didn't really profit at all. Hey, get your hands off me, stash. We found a homeless guy. Here he is. Let's kick his teeth in. Doosh. Keep, keep hitting. Keep hitting. Hobo Bo. I like him. Hobo Bo. Greatest warrior in all the land. Keep, keep, keep hitting him. There we go. Crit for 193 there. Brutal. We got the job done. 100 XP received. And we got some steroids. Oh, cool. So we didn't actually have to buy them anyway. We found them. So we checked the, we checked the right side. Did we get everything in here? Yeah, we did. Okay, okay, well that was an adventure. I wonder if we can just like do that again indefinitely. Grow for the future. I wonder if the trees have names. Oh, I can't check them. How unfortunate. Oh well. No no great loss. Let's go to the water cooler. Can we Cool water for cool guys. Well that's that's us then. Tick. Let's get another save on the go. And we'll head back up the top way. Because uh, there might have been something else up next to that guard that we didn't get. And we need to get everything. Because, oh Christ, there's a dead body. Herman, get out me home! Get out me home, he says. He's like, get out! I live in this. I live in, I live in a bin! First name, the. Last name, courier. Age, question mark, question mark. That says that, like. 
Fallout or something like that? Is that, is, is that? is that straight up New Vegas? Is that what we're looking at? Found another hole! All hail the chosen one! Is that all they say? All hail, all hail! You are the chosen one! It was said in the scriptures that you would come and find us. Here is all of the donations we have gathered from our mass. And we've got $5,000. What do we bring? MJ is the one true god. Or floss your teeth daily. Well, floss your teeth daily. The chosen one has spoken. All hail the chosen one. And what is that bit? No, it can't be true. False prophets. Brothers, we have sinned. We must punish ourselves for us. Our oh my god. What have I done? We had a following. But then they died. Oh well. Uh, that's a shame. We should uh, probably pretend that never happened. Let's head up into the law area. Cool water for cool guys. What's in this little side room? This is the right wing. It's full of ammo. <laughs> Let's see what they did there. It's full of political corrupt promises. They're all marked delayed eternally. Ooh, scathing. Liquidated assets inside because it's a water cooler. That's clever. It's full of guns. Right. Why make change when we can make a fortune? Jesus, it's got a thinly, thinly veiled uh, business bible. Thinly veiled um, political, political message here. I mean, to be fair, the entire game's kind of a thinly veiled political message, but mm, it's a little bit more blatant here. It's full of baloney. Oh, I see. <laughs> They're full of baloney. Clever jokes. It's full of ammo. They are actually quite clever, I suppose. It's a copy of the Declaration of Corporate Dependence. <laughs> it's full of guns. This place sounds like my kind of place. Although I'm not, I'm not particularly right wing. I like to think that I embody aspects of both the left and the nubile nuns <laughs> magazines. Oh dear. I like to think I embody left and right wing politics. Clarice, Clarice. Oh dear. Righty the rightest. I'm a little busy cleaning right now. Go bother those leftists. Okay, let's go bother the leftists then. I wonder what they're gonna have. Probably condoms and thing. <laughs> That's quite funny. If you're looking for a bit of extra work, I hear the leftist leader has a job opening available. So we can work for the lefties. I mean, okay. The ass is our cult symbol. Alright, I see. Death to the right wing, says Lars. Death to the right wing. We need to make change. As in, money change. What? Do you think I meant the laws? <laughs> That's rich. No bad, Rex, you shifty bastard. Telling your jokes. Telling your jokes. This water cooler accepts sandwich stamps. Sweet. I believe in plants' rights. Larry, there are much, much more significant things to be working about to be working on right now than the rights of Eh uh, fucking What was it? Aunt Auntie Bloody Can't believe this word isn't coming to me. Sentient and non-sentient beings. That's what I was looking for. God on me. Lefty the leftist. Hey you, you look like the kind of kid that can deliver. I've seen a number of handsome folks like you in my life, but none could ever deliver. Take this package over to the right wing and give it to the conservative leader. You got abortion pills. God almighty, you probably won't be too happy about that, I wouldn't imagine. Oh well. And then he knows about the ass. Not bad, let's go over to the right wing and see what he's got then for us to deliver. Not bad. Where is he? Is it the guy at the top? So, that liberal finally found someone that could actually deliver. You lost abortion pills. Guns for drugs, a classic political transaction. You got a shitload of guns. Take these back to that liberal scum. Cool, can we just like take the shitloads of, gun shitloads of guns? Where is it? Don't see it. Okay, so it's just a theoretical shitload of guns. Fair enough, fair enough. Maybe it's the deed to a shitload of guns, because a shitload of guns would be really heavy, difficult to carry around. Alright you, take these guns. I don't like the idea of guns, but I could use these. You lost the guns. Here's some money. We got a thousand dollars for for a divide, for a district divided. There you go, for a, for facilitating a transaction of shady purposes between two political candidates. There you go. We are just compromising the integrity of this entire justice system right here. 
Hey, as I was saying, like, I like left and right. Like, I'm all about personal freedom, but at the same time, like, give me, like, give me, give me the law. You know, fifty thousand in this law, in this lawyer will be our man. But like, you know, for example, I I am fine with firearms, and I think as long as they're controlled, like, then everybody should be able to own anything. As far as like, if you if you need to register for it, then fair enough. As far as I'm concerned. But like at the same time, like, like legalize the ganj and, su and such. Like, <laughs> no, more um more along the lines of just. I'd say I'm more, probably more left-wing than I am right-wing, thinking about it. But there is definitely an element of right-wing in there. I think that's true for most people, though. Everybody's like, oh, all these liberals, all these republicans. But at the end of the day, most people have used that embody both parties. It's just you only ever hear from the extremists for either side because they're the only ones who want to campaign. So remember that next time you generalise and say all liberals or republicans are X. You learn. You know game's done with crud. Either way, let's talk to this fella up the front. Teddy Sekra, welcome to the courthouse, where all of your legal dreams can come true, if you can afford it, that is. You must be Crun. It says here that you are to, re that you are to report to classroom, courtroom C. Fucking hell. It says here that you are to report to courtroom C for the Suit City versus Old Bag case. Sweet, courtroom C. Let's do it. Let's get some closure. Or, well, oh shit. We found oh, it's a just giving us the finger. Look at him, you vicious bastard, wastebasket Willy. Who do you think you are, wastebasket Willy? Just flat th tossing the tossing the bird at us like nothing on earth. You villain! I am gonna beat you senseless, even if you are just a trash can. He dodged the second. He recycled. He gained 24 XP, HP rather. Well, that's good for him. I, I like that he keeps things concurrent. He keeps smacking up. I like that this is more, this game is more humour than it is RPG. Like, I think that's a good thing. We got to level 6 and we beat up a little bit of a little basket man, which is pretty cool. Binders full of plant photos. These are just blank papers. These are emergency guidelines. Erased procedure. In case of an erased or a erased, please follow these steps. By following this guide, you can successfully avoid the erased. Step 1. Gather all important staff members into one room. Step 2. Make sure that all of these members take erased so that they won't be erased. Step 3. Erased. Well, there appears to be some sort of rampant censorship at work, which is a bit of a shift. Wow, there's a syringe of drugs! We've got to revive a viva, so if we die... Rev a viva. So if we die, we can restore our HP. And I'm thinking, let's pop a save, and then before we head into the courtroom, I think it's probably best if we end this part here, because whatever happens in there is probably going to take... A little while, and this episode's running on now. Uh, yes, so I've been enjoying this. this is going to end it for this sort of session of um, suits. I'm enjoying this. I think it's quite cool. I really like the sense of humour. It's quite like cut and scathing. I like all the little characters, so everybody's got their own little individual personality. This is actually really well written. Like, uh, I'm, I'm honestly quite surprised. It's a much better game than I thought it was going to be. I thought this would be just a little bit sort of plain, but it's actually got a lot of charm for it. Charm and like colour, ironically enough, it being all in black and white. I really do like the art style as well. Like how everything's like janky hand drawn. It's really quite aesthetically pleasing in its own way. Kind of suits the tone quite a lot. And it's good that it's just like bleak as fuck. It reminds me a lot of um, Lisa, the painful RPG, if, you, if anybody's played that, where it's just like this sort of like bleak as anything, but the humour is still there and it's actually enough to make you smile and laugh quite occasionally. So anyway, uh, if you enjoyed this, please remember to leave a like, comment or subscribe, all of those would be much appreciated as always, and if you didn't, then again, as always, you can also leave a comment, And well, I know you can leave a comment, like you know that full well, but like please do, so that I can hear your feedback, because it's always good to know how you can improve. Anyway, I have been Crun, this was Games Done with Crud in Suits the Business RPG. Uh, next week there will definitely be more of this. I know I'm going to be carrying on because I am fairly enjoying it. So uh, yeah, enjoy doing what you're doing in the meantime, and I will see you again next time. Bye-bye for now.